gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be telling you about a book that I got as a birthday present, which is Daddy the Whippy Kid. Thank you, Carolina, Emily, and Olivia for this book. This is one of my favorite books that I got for my birthday. So let's start up. Daddy the Whippy Kid. I really like this book. It tells about a kid that's called Greg Hefley. And that he wanted a journal. He specifically told his mom to, not the one that says diary, the one that says journal. But you know how moms can be. They always get diary. It's really, really funny. It's a cheesy book. It, it has a lot of pictures in it. Manny, the mom. Greg, his best friend Rowley, Roderick. My mom also got me the second book, which is Diary of a Wimpy Kid Roderick Rules, which is the second one. But this one is really funny because it has different, different, like it has pictures and, and stuff, like pictures of him doing stuff. And then see, like this one is funny. Dear Gregory, I am very sorry I chased you with a booger on my finger. Here, I put it on this paper so you can get me back. That was Freggy. And he also showed his secret freckle. And then he goes, eh, what should I name it? And he has a hair in it too. It was disgusting. And then Rowley doing PE class, he was like, hello, my name is Belly Button. Cause it was funny because there were skins and the other ones were shirts okay guys so let's start from the beginning so this book is about a kid who just started on middle school and so then he he wants it to be a journal not a diary so then what happens is this is how he goes to to um this is how he goes to um, through middle school and the problems he went through, like the cheese touch, he almost had the cheese touch. So the cheese touch is the a cheese that Mr. Lee appeared. Nobody knows who it was. Nobody threw it away, and there is is stand there waiting for his next victim. So there was this kid that was you no know, a different language, and they gave him the cheese touch. Cause the only way to lose the cheese touch is to touch somebody with the cheese touch. And then, and then he took it away, he back went to his country and he took the cheese touch away. And then he almost touched the cheese touch and almost had the cheese touch. You know, know what happens when you have the cheese touch? When you have the cheese touch, no, everybody's like 30 miles away from you. Nobody wants to get the cheese touch and nobody wants to be your friend if you touch the cheese touch. And at the end of this book, uh, they made some people that were doing haunted Halloween, during Halloween. Um, they got like a, a trimmer and they scrapped the painting of a truck from a bullies that bullied him and they got in trouble. So, and those same bullies went on to, into the school and told them that they, um, Rowley has to eat the cheese. And then when the principal came and told them, no, all the kids are allowed in the school property. But then, and then one kid said, oh, who ate the cheese? And then... Uh, and then Rowley was about to cry, and then he was about to say that he did, and then this is great. I ate the cheese. I have the cheese touch. But at then, whoever, um, if Rowley does something bad to him, he's going to tell the whole school who actually ate the cheese touch, which is Rowley. This book is really funny. Okay, so what happens in Greg's life? is that he has a little brother Manny and a bigger brother Roderick. And then he has his mom and his dad and Fredly and his best friend is Rowley Jefferson. So what happens in, the, in his life, he wants to be popular at school and doesn't want to make a mistake at school so he won't be uh, bad or uh, like he doesn't want to be, he wants to be famous. But so then in the book, so he has to go all through all Christmas, August, and the whole school semester trying to be nice and trying not to to be not famous. Like not like you know, if you, he wants to be famous and you, and then if he was trying not to 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 not do mistakes, so he won't be not famous. And then 
that's how what he wanted to happen in school and so so happened what he wanted to happen so so but it's a really nice book i like how it is and it is really it has cartoons if you watch the movie it says the cartoons part and then it shows the real life and it's exactly what's in the book and it's really cool so i like this book and this is my diary of the wimpy kid book that i have and i really like this book so the books you can actually connect is i have these two roger rules and the original but you can also get that straw dog days the ugly truth cabin fever you can also get the third wheel hard luck the long haul old school Double Doy, The Getaway, and um, it doesn't have it here, but The Wreck and Ball. And that's the whole collection you can get. I like that you're doing big kid. Um, and that's my video. I hope you guys liked it. Please subscribe, smash that thumbs up button, and those notifications. And comment down below or once you start reading them. Tell me which one's your favorite out of all of, out of, all of them once you read it. So see you guys later.